guys, we're having a PEC. You have to say what a PEC is. Chill. Yeah! Anyway, we're having a PEC because A-Lab will start tomorrow. And before any exam week, before any mocks or anything, for a flight, we always go and get breakfast. So we're at Mona Lisa. We're all finished, so I probably vlog too late. The plan for today, let me tell you the plan for today, the plan for today. Um, I need to pack my exam case. I need to make sure I have a uniform for tomorrow, just so I can be calm. So, I am on my break right now. I've just done, I listened to two sociology podcasts and was taking notes. And then I'm going to go back, do a 30 marker on education policies. And then I'm just going to spend the rest of the day doing like quick fire questions. Um, just really looking at research methods, trying to remember different case studies. Because the exam is tomorrow morning. Like I was just on the hectic teacher website and it said 19 hours to go. So just so everyone knows, FYI, I'm going to be looking crusty in these next three weeks vlogs. Because it's just going to be me at home or me crying or me at school. Those are the three states you're gonna see me in. A uh, two hour timer here. I'm gonna listen to just this music in the background and then I've got the paper here. And that's what we're doing. I still have 10 minutes left so that will be pretty good so I can okay I was vlogging but my phone literally ran out of battery so now it's like two hours later but what I was saying is I finished the essay I had 10 minutes to spare which was actually pretty good because that means I can take some more time to plan like my 30 and 20 marker just to have more security I don't really know what else I'm gonna do tonight I think I might like go through these like research methods um, like, I think if I do too much, I'm gonna stress myself out. So I'm, I'm trying to like, pretty, be calm. Morning everyone, it's 5.55. Just woke up, I have my A-level today. And I'm gonna get ready and use some time in the morning to revise. Ah! about these methods in context like methods in context so how would using a non-participant observation specifically help with I think we should go down at half past anyway because there's no point stressing around with all the notes. So Are you taking your notes with you? No, no I'm gonna put them on I was just gonna leave it here. I'm okay. okay, I'm back. Um so I finished my exam. It went okay. They stuck to the advanced information, even though some people felt like they didn't, because they outlined basically in the thing to revise marxization, no, to revise educational policies to do with marxization, raising standards, equality, stuff like that, and globalization. But yeah, they stuck to the advanced information, so it wasn't like biology, GCSE that I heard, apparently it was not on the spec. Uh, yeah, it was... It was okay. I'm gonna break it down here. Skip this. If you don't care about sociology, you can skip this part. But so this paper has a four, six, thirty, twenty, and ten marker. So I opened the paper. The four marker threw me off immediately. I was like, I don't know what this is. The six marker also threw me off. I was like, okay, because the first one was about competition between pupils, which I'd never heard, and the second one was about how education is patriarchal. And then I was like, okay. And then those were the last questions I did because I was kind of confused. The first 10 marker was on anti-school subcultures. And I think I did pretty well, but instead of giving two points, I think I kind of gave the same point with different examples. So I don't know how well that's going to go for me. The 30 marker, I actually felt pretty confident about that one. I think I did a good essay. I was evaluating. I was using sociologist examples. Like I think it was a pretty good 30 marker. The 20 marker is a different story because the item was really unclear because it was just like there was so little in the item but the question was so big because instead of picking either class gender or ethnicity the item literally just said class gender and ethnicity like it just threw it in like and the question was more about it was group interviews and it was about i don't remember what it was about yeah it was way too broad and the item was way too narrow so there was so much to say 
but it wouldn't have been using the item and you don't get marks if you don't use the item even though you can use own knowledge and the last 10 marker was official statistics as a social fact and i i revised social facts and i knew what it was but i literally just didn't answer it properly so i probably should have written about like i don't know i don't know i don't know so this paper sociology paper one is the most confident one out of all eight or nine papers i'm gonna sit and i've wanted to feel more secure but i don't feel as sure in my knowledge i felt like i knew so much about the subject like i revised so much for it but in a way that was so pointless because basically four or five things like came up out of like the hundreds that we've revised so i don't know exactly how i feel yet but i do know that i'm really hungry so i'm gonna get something to eat i also returned my asos package finally i literally forgot that i had to return it until i was editing my vlog the other day and i saw it in the background i was like okay that needs to go but yeah i'm gonna revise for a bit i'm gonna finish watching descendants i started it on sunday and i have over halfway left and then i'm gonna start revising geography because i have my test on friday and it's not looking good for me i can't lie i made a map on 5.5 which is like surpluses in the water cycle which is like flooding now i'm doing this one which is deficits which is drought um but i'm not going to finish this because i need to get ready to go to school because i have a revision session so i'm going to eat some lunch get dressed get ready leave in about 45 minutes so today's outfit really is like i've tried to put my own twist on it and it's just my uniform that's it I wanted to make a joke about how I wear uniform, but then I very quickly realized it was not funny. Look at it, it's all cloudy. Still looks pretty though. As a geographer who's doing her A-level, I can tell you that the cloud's getting full of water and we're entering a low pressure system. Um, once again, no one cares. Okay, bye guys. Guys, I'm genuinely scared to leave the house because the thunder is rumbling like it's no one's business. What if I get electrocuted? There's no lightning, it's just thunder. I'm just scared. Just wind there. Okay, I'm gonna listen to some music, put my umbrella up, and I'll see you guys in my revision session. <laughs> guys, I'm actually gonna suck. <laughs> what the hell? It's actually getting really rainy now. Oh, I need to put my phone away. Hey guys, the sun is really choosing to shine through right now. I am in the same jumper I've been wearing all week because it's comfortable. Um, I'm listening to music right now. I'm finished revision for today. It's about 7.30 and I'm kind of like gone downhill. So I'm just going to stop today. But oh, I put it away in my folder, but I did all my mind maps for tectonics and for carbon so tomorrow i'm just gonna have to do case studies and then i'm gonna do water tomorrow oh no sorry i did water and tectonics tomorrow i'm gonna do carbon um and yeah it's going pretty well actually i'm gonna do the yearbook now we've got some changes we've got to make but yeah i'll see you guys later because i think me and neil watch a movie Guys, I've just looked at myself and I... <laughs> this is horrifying. What the hell is going on? So now it's basically about doing all the case studies for the rest of the day. And then I'm going to try and make my own questions. Because obviously, when you're doing advanced information and you do past papers and everything, they have questions on the whole spec. And while that is useful, it's kind of annoying because the whole spec isn't relevant and we only need to learn some of it so the questions usually aren't tailored to this specifically so i'm gonna have to kind of go through this and make my own 12 markers 20 markers because this is a huge section it's so annoying this plus water is 49 marks 49 marks are you like it's more than coasts and we spent an entire year on coasts like it's unreal we've done this stuff in three months maybe four months and that's what 
more than 50 percent paper is on which i still can't wrap my head around they arrived how can i cover my over they came i'm really excited i don't know how many there are <gasps> wow three four five six seven oh my god we've got a blue we've got a white <gasps> we've got a pink a green a yellow an orange oh my god not my favorite one being left for last a purple Hey guys, so the time right now is basically six o'clock. I'm in the dining room now, still doing some more 12 markers. And I have this one left to do, so I need to do like one more paragraph in conclusion. I have two more 12 markers to do. Then I'm gonna take a break and then I'm going to map out some coasts. Okay guys, so I don't know what time it is right now, but it's kind of late, but it's not late, it's kind of early. But I'm gonna go to bed because I'm really, really tired and I'm planning to wake up tomorrow at like 5.30, maybe five o'clock, just so I can get some extra revision in. But I'm not feeling confident for tomorrow's exam. Like, I've been studying so much for it the last few days, but like, I kind of wish maybe I did less sociology and more geography just because I should have just focused more on it and that is my own fault because I got to focus on sociology because it was first instead of what I needed to work on more. I'm gonna try and get a good night's sleep instead of focusing on the exam tomorrow but I'm not feeling good about it. I can't lie to you. The bus is in two minutes. Um, and yeah, I'm reading through one of my notes on different theoretical frameworks. Anything you want to say? Sorry? Anything you want to add? So everyone knows I'm at school now. Kiara's here, Eva's there. Katrina's missing. No, she's, outside. she's outside. She's outside. Um, she's yeah, I don't feel any better than I did earlier. I cannot lie. I need my case studies for these bitches now. Wait. I'm just gonna say Iceland. Yeah, no, Miss Miss said just to yeah. say the Icelandic volcano. Well, okay. Okay. No, but that's not managed. So that it was a mag no, magnitude nine. No, magnitude eight. Yeah, that's right, me. Magnitude. Wait, I can't spell my language. Guys, basically, I personally feel really underprepared for this. Why is there two shish ones? Because they're for different things. Oh, so one of them was about comparison to hate. The other ones are more detailed, basically. I don't know. We'll see you after. Say bye. No, vlog. Come pick me up. I'm scared. Hey. To all my fans out there, help me. Guys, we're going to learn about BAM now. I love BAM. Hey guys, so paper has just been sat. The general consensus is that it wasn't good. Okay. okay, so how was your timing? I finished it, but it was kind of shit though. Why am I glowing and not in a good way? Thanks, thanks, thanks. Good <laughs> thanks. Um, basically. How about your timing? Did you did you like rush? I basically I started the last twenty marker when it was ten twenty nine. So I gave myself half an hour. Oh, so you finished all of it, like perfect. No, because I hadn't done the six marker either. Oh shit. So I had half an hour to do six marker and the 20 marker. The 20 marker only really took me like 24 minutes, but that's because I didn't do it properly. Like oh. I think it looks more like a 15 marker than a 20 marker, you know? Mm. Like I still, yeah, you I know my problem last time where I made too many points, but not enough detail. Um, anyway, it was okay. It was, I think, we were very very stressed before <clears throat> i'm stressed now bye bye cambridge bye bye birdies. stop saying that yeah i'll slap you if you say it again 
<laughs> and I'll, I'll do it on camera. This uh, is the this is the advanced information I was trying to learn this morning. Is that what came up? Uh, yeah. Yep. <laughs> Okay, so I look an absolute mess right now, but we're gonna be ignoring that. So it's Saturday night. This morning was not very productive for me. I didn't do any work until one o'clock just because I was really tired. And I think maybe it's because I was drained from this week and just doing revision constantly. Um, I did about four hours today, which isn't as much as I hoped, but I still got a bit done. And I did some more geography revision for paper two. This was the first week of A-levels. It wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be, I can't lie to you guys. It was okay. I gave the sociology paper like an 8.5 out of 10 and the geography paper like a 7 out of 10. So hopefully the others go this well. But I've also underestimated kind of exams in general because I had two this week and they were on Monday and Friday. And the next ones I have is two on Tuesday, one on Wednesday and then Monday, Wednesday, Friday. So they're going to come very quickly. Um, the next week of this is going to be like a half term vlog. So again, lots of time lapses. And I'm really sorry about that, but that's just what it's going to be like. But yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. If you guys did either the sociology or geography paper, whether it was the same exam board or a different one, comment down below with how you felt about it. And yeah, I'll see you guys next week for a new video. Bye.